Colorado's most fun afternoons with Scotty K. Claudia from Plainfield, you had an awkward hello or goodbye, huh? It was a goodbye, it yes. Was a goodbye. Okay, so you heard what happened with Jimmy Allen. We were backstage. I don't know why every time he passed by, I saluted him. Like, why did I do that <laughs> so many times? And then he even tweeted me, and he was like, it's all good, bro. I'm like, oh, my God, it's so embarrassing. <laughs> so what did you do? Um, so I work at a doctor's office, and I was helping this patient over the phone. And then I always have a habit of saying either uh, you're welcome or no problem. So I blurred out your problem. Yeah. So, <laughs> this poor person's like, I need medical attention. Oh it's your problem. <laughs> yes. I was like, oh, my God, I'm so sorry. Bert from Mundelein, you had an awkward hello or goodbye? Uh, yeah, it was actually the first time I was meeting my girlfriend's father. We were at Strawberry Fest in Long Grove. She goes, oh, there he is. There he is. There's Dick. I said, oh. So she screams, hey, hey, Dad. And I'm not going to call him Dad, so I'm loud. I go, hey, Dick. <laughs> he looks over, finds us, comes walking over, introduces himself, and says, I go by Rick. I go by I Rick. Oh, no. <laughs> so his name wasn't even the other thing you said. All right, Teresa from Shorewood, you had an awkward goodbye or hello? Yes, I was a, I'm a dental hygienist, and one of my patients was a retired priest, and I was pregnant, and I was telling him about it, and he, I thought was going to high-five me for it, but he was going to bless me, so I kind of <laughs> high-fived him, and uh, it was really weird. So did you throw your <laughs> hand up and you high-fived him? Yeah, like I put my hand up, because he put his hand up to bless <laughs> me, and I put my hand up, and it got weird at That's, the front end. It got weird. That's really <laughs> funny.